Welcome to Avalon University School of Medicine. My name is Dr. Samir Fateh and I serve as the President and Executive Dean. At this time, I'm going to introduce you to our medical university and what we have to offer. Avalon University School of Medicine was first started in 2003 and it is currently chartered on the island of Kersau. In regards to accreditations, it is currently recognized by ECFMG, IMED, and WHO. And due to these accreditations, our graduates are able to practice medicine in the United States, Canada, or almost anywhere in the world. The mission at Avalon University School of Medicine is to educate students in both the science and art of medicine. Our ultimate goal is to really make sure that all Avalon students build a solid foundation of the basic sciences on the island. We expect all Avalon students to be highly dedicated and determined, and of course we provide the direction. Kersau is located in the deep south of the Caribbean and 50 miles north of Venezuela. Kersau is also located in a hurricane-free zone and is part of what's called the ABC Islands. With a population of 150,000 people, Kersau is one of the most diverse and modern Caribbean islands. At Avalon University School of Medicine, we offer two types of programs. We have a five-year pre-med MD program and a four-year MD program. Now for the five-year pre-med MD program, it's designed for high school graduates or for students who have not completed their undergraduate degree. For the four-year MD program, the two primary requirements is a student must have completed their science-based undergraduate degree or 90 credit hours of college coursework done. During the five-year pre-med MD program, students would need to complete four semesters of pre-medicine. Each semester is 15 weeks long. During pre-medicine, this is where students will complete the prerequisite courses and achieve their 90 credit hours. Once students complete four semesters of pre-med, they would automatically go into the MD program. MD program is four additional semesters, and during MD program, this is the most critical juncture during a medical student's career. This is where students would take what's called the basic science courses and it is very important for all Avalon students to build a solid foundation of these basic sciences. Now for the five-year program, the total time spent on the island would be 2.6 years. And for the students who are in the four-year MD program, the total time spent on the island would be 1.3 years. Once students finish their time on the island, they'll come back to Youngstown, Ohio at, at our admissions office for what's called the fifth transitional semester. The fifth semester is an eight-week long semester and this is where students would complete three parts to it. Introduction to clinical medicine, introduction to residency, and Kaplan review. Once students complete the fifth semester, this is where they would take time aside to study for what's called the US MLE Step 1 examination. The US MLE Step 1 examination really covers what students learn during the MD portion of medical school. It is a very important exam. After students complete their U.S. Assembly Step 1 examination, this is when they would start their 72 weeks of clinical rotations. The 72 weeks of clinical rotations are at our ACGME affiliated hospitals around the United States. The 72 weeks of clinical rotations are split up into core rotations and elective rotations. This is a very interesting time during medical school because every, all the knowledge that students have learned on the island, all of the basic science coursework gets to be applied in a hospital setting. During the 72 weeks of clinical rotations, students would take what's called the US MLE Step 2 examination. The US MLE Step 2 is a more clinically based exam. Everything that students learn during their core rotations would be asked on the US MLE Step 2 exam. Once students take the US Only Step 2 examination and have completed 72 weeks of clinical rotations, they have met the requirements of Avalon University School of Medicine and are set to graduate as medical doctors. During this time period, this is when students would seek for residency placements and specialties around the United States. Now why choose Avalon University School of Medicine? There are many factors where we feel very confident in our medical education and as a medical university. One of the biggest things that we have been really stressing from the beginning is the medical education, the education on the island. Uh, the time spent during the basic sciences is such a critical point during a medical student's career and we really focus on the curriculum. We want to make sure that our students are not only learning the knowledge but also having a full grasp and understanding of the basic sciences. 
our faculty. You know, one of the main criteria of having faculty is that they must be medical doctors. Uh, even more, they must have experience with the US MLE examinations. Everything on the island, especially during the MD portion of medical school, when it comes to quizzes, exams, teaching methods, it's all US MLE oriented. Having a US MLE oriented curriculum is very beneficial and has been very beneficial in our success rate of our students passing the US MLE and obtaining residencies. One of the other key factors of Avalon University School of Medicine is that all of our rotations are guaranteed in the United States. For all of our students that want to do rotations, they have the option of doing rotations where they want to do it and in which specialty they want to do the rotations. At Avalon University School of Medicine, students are not just a number. On the island, with our small class sizes, students get individual attentions from our preceptors and professors. In the clinical setting, the doctors give direct attention to all of our students. Finally, I may have not answered all of the questions that you may have. I would advise to call our admissions office and speak with one of our admissions officers. Also, our website. Our website is quite informative, so check out avalonu.org. If you want to interact with current students, please visit our Facebook page.